there guys, Coaster Chal here, Doncaster born but built for theme park news and welcome to a theme park news update from Six Flags Fiesta Texas and uh, this is on 2022 construction, oh boy, oh boy, this is going to get interesting, so the site that I called, I called it the site uh, the official site with that white building, I, I believe it used to be an old stadium or an old building that, was in, that hasn't been used for a few years, thanks to the comment section from the previous update. That building or around that site, that whole site that I circled with the, the fender bender, I believe that attraction was in there as well. That has all been um like circled that's all that's all been fenced off so i'm going to share a post with you from the president uh, jeffrey sieber and share my thoughts on this so before we get started guys make sure you like the video if you loved it comment down below your thoughts and opinions please keep commenting and pray, praying for christian erickson on his recovery as well guys it re would really mean a lot to christian's family if you do keep uh you know you know keep him going on his recovery he's awake and he's alive thank goodness so keep him going on his recovery uh from what's happen today please please keep uh praying for him in the comments down below uh also guys subscribe click the case boss in this youtube video um and it'd be really appreciated if you do keep praying for christian erickson on social media because you know i'm sure he'd i'm sure he'd love to see every single one of us you know keep him going uh also guys check the description down below for social media links and also uh the google forms so you can submit your own video ideas and for now guys let's have a look at exactly what is going on uh with 65 fs texas on their brand new construction for 2022 it's getting very exciting so as you can see right there on your screen jeffrey siebert's been posting on instagram with the caption and so it begins hashtag sfft and with the teasers that's been going around that we reported on a few days ago or in the last week or two uh, it's getting very exciting indeed walls have gone up around that site i will share the site that i circled uh, before on google maps on your screen now and uh, this is the site in question it is of course uh, where that building was where the fender benders attraction is um, you can see it's a it's a quite a big big site uh, it's a quite specific plot of land for a couple of different options so I'm now going to share my thoughts on what I think is going to be happening uh, with this site there we are ladies and gentlemen thrill six of all ages so it begins. Uh, Six Flags Fiesta Texas uh, teasing for 2022 uh, with um, the construction with the walls going up around the site. So it begins. Six Flags Fiesta Texas well in the front runner's reign for a 2022 coaster along with Six Flags Over Georgia and we already know uh, Six Flags Magic Mountain and technically Frontier City uh, potentially getting the relocation uh, relocated Goliath from Six Flags New England for next season. That's the, the rumour that's been swelling about over the last couple of months. Uh, so potentially four new roller coasters for, uh, for Six Flags next year which is unbelievable uh, and take into account that VPair is going to be delayed and Sidewinder Safari is going to be delayed from the previous year or two at La Ronde and Discovery Kingdom respectively that's six coasters for next year technically which is unbelievable uh, for Six Flags a great way to bring back the crowds fully in 2022 fingers crossed if all goes to plan um, but there we go it, it's very exciting isn't it now I talked about my predictions I think there's only a couple of things this could be and you know it's very hard with Fiesta Texas because they've already got a Raptor they've already got a numerous type of other coasters so there's only a few directions you could go so there's very limited choice and there's two choices I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with either a West Coast racer style coaster so a, a dueling Mobius launched uh, the Mobius loop launched premier uh, coaster or and SNS axes. Now I might be pushing the boat there with the axes because SNS, you know, I think with the axis coaster, we'll probably see the first one of those around the 2023, 2024 mark. And I'd be very surprised if we got one earlier, but I, I, it wouldn't be completely out of the question, would it? You know, America likes to be really innovative with their stuff, so, um, you know, it's not completely out of the question if uh, Fiesta Texas is getting one of these before anywhere else or before the scheduled date, what we thought the scheduled date was for, um, 
for all of that. But I think it's going to be very, very interesting to see exactly what direction the 655 Texas is going to go. Obviously, the Premier Coast has come up because obviously there was a rumour about a year ago uh, with the with the, the late announcements that could have happened in 2020, what, uh, 2020 for 2021, uh, but they've pushed it back, I, I, I would assume. So, um, obviously, the rumours were an RMC Raptor, a Premier Coaster project, and a follow-up to Max Force. So... I mean, Over George is still in line for the, the Max Force. Uh, Fiesta Texas could be in line for the, the, the West Coast Racer style Premier launch coaster concept uh, as part of the, as the Premier Coaster project. Um, so I think it would fall in line with the rumor. Obviously, there was other stuff rumored as well Zampella Family Ride, Screaming Swing, Flat Ride. Whether that happens or not, we're not too sure. Um, but it's going to be very, very interesting. It's going to be very, very exciting as well. So uh, there we go, guys. Thank you very, very much for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Keep praying for Christian Eriksen in the comments down below. I'm sure I'd really appreciate that. And uh, for now, guys, I'm Coach Chell. Keep on the coast life. And I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have a six-five fantastic day.